Hello and welcome back to what's the box? It's box. Hello. Uh, firstly, sorry that we've been gone for over a month this time. Over a month. About Something a month. like that. Uh, the garden. E3. Uh, personal shit, including our our stove top hob breaking and various other things. Uh, just meant it's been a bit manic at the weekends, hasn't it? Um, so yeah, but we're back. And I'm waffling because I'm really tired. We've been busy. We have been so busy. I did seven hours of gardening yesterday. So yeah, I just, I'm melting. Um, but it also means we're hilariously overdue on a fuck ton of stuff that you guys have sent, including birthday presents. Fucking hell. This is, there's something else that I haven't collected from the office. Someone's lucky, aren't they? Um, it's, I don't think it's all birthday, but it all came around the birthday. So, so you're just claiming it all as I'm your birthday. I'm just claiming it all as birthday. Gifts for viewers four, I think we're on now. Uh, we've also got some sweets as a separate video coming soon. Uh, and uh, a little bit of gaming swag as a separate video. It might already soon. be out though. Depends what order you put them out in, it? Depends it? on what, yeah. Like, when, I, when I finally Are sleep, you a time traveller? I wish I was a time traveller, I'd get so much more done, holy shit. Be like Hermione slash... You would travel, um, you would travel around in time to penny, do more work. The Queen's nose person. I would travel around in time so that I didn't have to do any fucking work. I could just be, I could just have being payday. What, forever? Forever, couldn't I? Think about it, use your brain, then Hannah. It would be Groundhog Day, it would be boring. Only if you did the same things every day. That's true. Yeah? Broaden well, you knew, up your mind. You knew what the weather is every day and it would reset every day, so you couldn't go anywhere super far away. So, what's the point? Uh, so, this is the first one. I think I think this might be from Pyro Dancer, but I'm not 100% sure, uh, as it's arrived what? separate to everything else. This <clears throat> is a make your own doggies treat kit. So, it's got a recipe book in it. Oh my god. Look! Oh. Look! It's got little shapes of bones. I'm oh, sorry, that was my cue, wasn't it? Sorry, yes. Yes, look. So this is oh. Bake Your Own Tasty Treats with our fun Make Your Own Doggies Treat Kit. Recipe booklet, cutters, handy treat bag with you to take on walks. Do not eat, throw away. Recipe book is in English only. I did expect it to maybe include, oh, I don't know, some of the ingredients, but I guess not. Carrot bites. Now, uh, I said if we bought this that we would make them and make some for calf's dogs, Doug and Arby. Oh, right, okay. I do happen to know that they like carrots, so carrot bites. I have given them carrots before. Yes, carrot bites might be good. They were very pleased. Also, banana and peanut bones. They also like peanut butter. Um, blueberry and flax bones. Apple, they also like. Apple and oat bites. Uh, cheddar and rosemary, they don't need cheese. Can we look at the booklet? I mean, yes, it's it's fairly fairly standard. Uh, it also says Turn like the page. It also says like people, some dogs could be sensitive to wheat and dairy, so they haven't actually made an effort in the first place about finding Boink. alternatives. But that's fine. Uh, th they'll probably be alright with wheat and dairy. Let me go to the carrot one. There you go. Carrots. So at some point in a future video, we'll cock about with that. Mm. I don't know how complicated it is. It looks like you basically just make cookies. Bit wobbly then. You? I have to swap hands. Oh. Um, yeah, you're literally just making cookies, but for dogs. So yeah, we'll do that at some point. That'd be yeah. nice. Little bit of a doggy treats for the calves. Uh, so thank you and very also, much. also we can make human treats and make them look like dog treats. Yes, we can. With the cutters. Yes, we can. I think this is related to the dog treats. It might not be. Whoever you are, possibly Pyro Dancer. Thank you. Unfortunately, Amazon just didn't really include any information. Uh, so we just have to guess. Um, but oh, we've got, it's a sewing time owl thing, a patchwork owl uh, from the Crafty Kit Company. Those crafty, Bitches. crafty companies. <laughs> So uh, that's a nice little, in fact, actually, that's probably quite a good little stream one because it's all in there. It's reasonably compact. Uh, apparently it's two out of three skill level, possibly. I don't know, it scares me somewhat, but I don't really get how difficult it could be. I think it'd be fine. Medium. I think it's just, yeah, you just sort of stuff it, don't you? And then sew a little bit off. It's like making a cushion. So um, cool. thank you. Do this, uh, and also with that, I've got. 
It's a grow your own suck honeysuckle. I was oh. going to say grow your own suckle. I was going to like a grow your own birthday cake. It is literally a grow your own, yeah. So you get a packet of honeysuckle seeds, a coconut husk starter plant pot, compost disc, plant marker. Mm. Place disc in pot, add water, watch the disc expand. So your seeds place a winter so water regularly, watch it grow. That's cool. Lovely. Um, I don't know. It's right up your alley. It is, isn't it? It worries me though, because the enabling from all levels now is getting quite you don't out need of hand. Any, you don't need any enabling. Birthday, it was, here's some plant vouchers. Oh, look. Coconut husk. Look at that. Ooh. There's the compost disc. It's going to expand. You can watch it expand. You can watch it expand. Um, oh shit! Get a I'll, lollipop stick. I'll plant that later. No, that's your your plant your... marker. Yeah. Just pop that. It is a little bit too big for the the actual box. It's sort of sprawled out, didn't it? To be fair, it's coconut husk, so it's fairly resilient. So in you go. You go back in there somehow. Uh, honeysuckle seeds. Reading words. Nice, I'll deal with that later. Thank you very much. Cool. Impossible, mysterious person. I'm going to pop you back on the tripod. Please do. Whoops. Okay. We then have something that I feel is not only a mood, but just my general life from Ian. It says, for your love of coffees and notebooks. That's not, that's not from Ian. That's a Christmas card from Duddy we found at the office. Oh, okay. Six months too late. Thanks, Duddy. Thanks, Duddy. I'd already said thank you to him, but yeah, nice card. It's a beautiful card. I literally went, hi, Duddy, it's June. Thank, <laughs> thank you. And he He's, said, who's he June? a picture of Libby. Oh, I was like, what, I was like, what the fuck is, and then opened this and went, oh. She does look like that. She does. Kind of pissed off little face. Yeah. So thank you, Duddy, for the, um, Oh, Again, you didn't. Got off the tripod then. <laughs> Thank you, Danny. Uh, yeah, it just it basically must have got lost somewhere around Jingle Jam. It's a nice, a nice little happen. card. It can happen. There's a lot of posts around Christmas as well. So yeah, this is from Ian, and it says first I drink the coffee, and then I do the things, and it's a notebook. Oh, excellent! It's a handy little notebook to have. Um, we always need notebooks, don't we? You've always got a notebook. I always need notebooks for puzzle things, and actually, this would be quite handy because normally it's a nice big one. I end up going yeah over to the next page, and I'm like, oh fuck! So this will help a lot with that. This could be the puzzle book. I do the things, it, it, debatable, but I do drink the coffee. So thank you. Yeah. This book has helped my family through over 20 years of dog ownership. You keep bantering about getting a dog in the future, so a little something to help prepare you. This is from Kimchi Tsuzuku oh, or, or Michelle. <laughs> because <laughs> I've definitely <laughs> butchered that pronunciation. But uh, there's two books in here. The first one being Hand Lettering for Beginners. So I've got Very some nice. calligraphy stuff. Um, so at some point we'll uh, have, have a- pens and stuff? I need to get some pens really, I've but- I've got some pens. Oh, have you? I don't um, think that they are calligraphy pens, but I've got but I thought hundreds of different nibs. For us to try different weird things. Um, or just for me to learn better calligraphy. Look at that, that's beautiful. Imagine trying to make that. That is beautiful. Like do a strem with some watercolour inky things. My handwriting's not that neat. Yeah, well mine's dreadful, but I would like to... My handwriting. I'd like to learn to be able to do, because Nina can make amazing art, like she just writes and it looks amazing, right? It would be my, really handy to I just write and it looks amazing, it. but it's for a different kind of amazing. Yeah. My handwriting looks like a doctor's written it with his feet. Or her, <laughs> or her feet. <laughs> Their feet. Um, yeah, there we go. So that's book one. Thank you. Book two. This is from Brian Kilcommons and Sarah Wilson. Good owners, great dogs. Look, there's me and my dogs. There's also me and Libby and the dog. There's also you and the dog. We're now with two new dog. chapters on puppy, puppy development and dominance aggression. Oh my god. Gosh. Wow. So that's like using a crate, puppyhood, bringing your puppy home, litter, not litter training, uh, that's cats. Um, well that's something to just have a look at, Using isn't it? the lead correctly, daily routine, general nursing, uh, 
Wow, okay. The enforced down. There's some training things. Yeah. Like it literally tells you all the hand pot gestures and everything. The psychology of training. Oh my god. I'm good at training. You can tell. You are, yeah, but you're you, you came how, from a gun dog family, so Well Libby is trained within an inch of her life. She's like a coiled Spring. She's just waiting waiting on my every word and command. I just have to look at something and she knows. This is one we could do with teaching the cat. Leave it. Leave it. Or just stop those, it. Those are some of the human words she doesn't understand. No. Then we have off. Off. Which is something that our dog is definitely going to learn is off. As in piss off and fuck off. No, as in don't jump Bugger at people off. at the door because sometimes you accidentally nut them in the groin. <laughs> That happened to me yesterday. <laughs> oh, with your friend's dog. When I went to see my friend and his dog, and we opened the door. Incoming. And I said, Whoop, hello. I said hello to the dog, and the dog punched me in the dick. <laughs> yeah, I'll be, I'll be uh, basically bounced up at me you and know, used my groin for a foothold. So you know when we were talking <laughs> about messing up the shot? Yeah. It is now messed up. Yeah, of course it is. You're a messy shot. What are you doing? Just looking behind it to see what's there. There's Look, nothing you see there. that? Yeah, there's no toys. Excuse me. I'm trying to film. Cat yeah. butt. Are you going to settle down? You Just going to lie on that cardboard. Yeah, there we go. Hello. That's acceptable. That's all Libby wants in the world, isn't it? Uh, treat her with dignity and respect, please. <laughs> what's in here? You have to let me open it first. What's in here? Mm. What's in here? Now this is from Pyro. So thank you Pyro. Can you just hang on please? I can't open it if you're... It feels nice on that face. You. So, here we go. This is... Libby's just cleaning her chest, it's fine. Cat bookshelf. Oh wow, that's cool. It's a puzzle. Let me get a... Yes. Uh, this can... is from Pyro. It says, happy birthday to you, Salty Queen. Thanks for the awesome streams. I hope you have a fantastic next year. Thank you, Pyro. At some right. point, we'll try can and you, do this. Can you lean it downwards? Yes. No, upwards. Not that far upwards. Downwards a bit. It's very difficult for me to not get a reflection. I know, because it's cellophane. That's very cool. Thousand pieces. Yeah. No, that should be that. I think that's going to be a little bit easier just because it's not quite as. Um... It's got an easier picture on it. That last jigsaw was insane. Yeah, well, I think we went a bit too hard, too far. Like that. Too was... hard, too soon. Yes, uh, but I do like the. Uh, I do like the names of. There the... you are. You look lovely now. Hold the jigsaw up. I do like the names of the the jigsaw piece. Uh, the Hold books. It up. So like the Great Catsby. Do a smile. Bro meow. Do a smile. Lip love. Do a smile. Kind of. I'm trying to get a thumbnail. <laughs> trying to get a nice thumbnail, but Libby just looks angry. Why do you look so angry? Why? Why are you angry? Why does she cry? Recycled Precious. materials. Oh, from this. Mm. this. Oh, nice. Oh, that, Stab her oh lips. thank you. Thank you very much. That was a bit wet. Thank you for your love. That's very appreciative. Um, so yeah, there we go. Do we need to do bye bye times? We do need to do bye bye times. Um, thank you very much for joining us. As I said, hopefully content will be a little bit more regular again now. We're past the busiest part of everything. Um, I don't believe you. I don't, no, no, because <laughs> we're not even in really my busy time. You didn't really lie with conviction, man. <laughs> we're not even in my busy time. Currently it's busy time because of the plants and, and DIY and all the stuff you need to do while the weather's good. And then later in the year, it's, oh shit, all the games are coming. Oh God. Oh yeah, and I've got two trips coming up in the next month. Not even counting personal trips. Nice. I've got work trips, so ignore what I just said about regular content. We'll see what we can do. Um, as and when, we'll get you more videos. We will squirt them out as soon as we can. Yes, we will. Um, so thank you very much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you have enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time for, I don't know, more more stuff on what's in the box. What's what? Thank you for watching. Goodbye. She's scratching her chin. Oh, it's really itchy. Oh, oh yes. Oh.